Good morning, Eagle Nation News. I'm Ben Fine. Ah! What is that? Why do you always do that? Why do you always say good morning, Eagle Nation News? You are the news. We are the news. They are not the news. Don't say good morning, Eagle Nation News. Crap! Did I say that? I don't think I said that. I did? I said that? Well, okay, anyway. Good morning, Eagle Nation News. I'm Ben Fine. And I'm Mackenzie Hamilton. Today on the show, we'll take a look at many of the things that we do every day on the show. And we will sit down with whoever shows up in the last five seconds before the show. All that plus Austin Garcia on sports, Hannah Dennis has your weather, and Cutter Nielsen with the bullet. Eagle Nation News starts right, right now. now. So, Mackenzie, tell me what uh, it's been like being an anchor on Eagle Nation News. Mm -hmm. yes. All right. Well, uh, is, is so you've I guess you've enjoyed it then. Yeah. 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 yeah? Okay. And it's uh, I guess something maybe you're going to want to do in the future. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, that was very insightful. Mackenzie, thank you very much. Um, when we come back, we're going to kick it over to Austin Garcia with some sports. Clear! Khalil, do you think you can get off your phone for just two seconds? Lou Allen, do you think you can pick up the pace on a teleprompter? Are you kidding me? Jeez, the script should have been done hours ago. Are you serious? I know you'll see somehow the world will change for me and be so wonderful. Okay, people, we're back in five, four, three. Welcome back. Uh, let's kick it over to Austin Garcia now. He's standing by at the sports deck. Austin? Good morning, Eagle Nation. I'm Austin Garcia, as if you didn't already know that. Let's start it off with girls soccer. Tuesday night, the Eagles took the pitch against the less than good Sherman Bearcat team. Wait, did I read that right? Less than good? Really, Brady? Can't we just say bad or underwhelming? Why are you yelling at me? God! God bless. Anywho, the Eagles got off to a hot start going in the half with a 3-0 score and never looked back. Behind some fancy footwork and a scrappy defense, they took home the dub with a final score of 6-0 with goals from Gabby Goldenfoot Gamboa, Brianna Can't Touch This Pascal, and Caitlin I Can't Think of a Nickname Right Now, so I'm going to go Harvard Crimson. They rounded out the game with a hat trick from freshman standout Diana. Did I mention that I'm a freshman, Ordonez? The girls play McKinney North at home this Friday. Come on out and see what the Eagle Soccer Club have cooking this year. I'm hoping it's fajitas. For Eagle Nation Sports, I'm Austin Garcia. And now JT Graham is standing by with legendary producer Brian Kennedy. JT, what you got? I'm sitting down with the man, the myth, the legend, Mr. Brian Kennedy. Now, Brian, as I understand, you're working on a very important project. Is that right? Well, now, JT, I don't know if, in, if very many people know this about me, but I'm a bit of an amateur filmmaker myself. Well, not a lot of people know what it takes to make a film. I mean, I do, but right, not I, every, it's incredibly difficult. Luckily, I'm pretty good at it, so I find it quite satisfying. I have a clip of some of my early work. Can we roll that? Hi. Thanks for joining us for another episode of Love Your Body, Don't Do Drugs. Today, Dr. D will be discussing the effects of inhalants. Take it away, Dr. D. Thank you. Man, that is some great stuff. Enough about me. What uh, project are you currently working on? I'm going to have to stop you right there. That's all the time we have on the show. Thank you for your insight. Camera one, camera two, camera one, camera two. This is fun. Camera one, camera two. Ethan, what are you doing? What do you ever do? Yeah, I've got lights. What time is lunch? Does anybody have any ketchup? Gargus, you know you're not supposed to eat in the control room? Ugh! Oh, God! Hey, can I have one? Shut up. I can't hear anything. No one's talking. But I'm concentrating. I'm trying to text my girlfriend. Does 
Does your mom know you're doing that? And now let's kick it over to Hannah Dennis in the Eagle Nation Weather Center. Good morning, Prosper High School. I'm Hannah Dennis with your daily weather forecast. Did you know once in England, because of a water spout, it actually rained frogs? Oh, and colored moons are due to different atmospheric issues and could probably turn the moon different colors like blue, orange, red. Oh yeah, and a fire whirl is a tornado spinning close to a forest fire. That's pretty neat, right? Also, there are such things as watermelon snow, and it has green algae containing secondary red carotenoid pigment and chlorophyll, but I probably wouldn't eat it. On this day in 1986, Bangladesh was hit by the biggest hailstorm ever recorded. They weighed two pounds apiece and killed 92 people. Now on to our three-day forecast. What? You mean, I'm out of time? Well, how was I supposed to get through all the fun facts in such a short amount of time? Well. That's all for now. I'm Hannah Dennis, and in 1967, a hurricane unleashed 115 tornadoes over Texas. Okay, uh, that is a lot of interesting facts there, Hannah. And to think, all I wanted to know is whether it was going to rain or not on Saturday. All right, well, Carter Nielsen standing by to give you all the announcements that you need to know in and around Prosper High School. This is your bullet. Hey, PHS, I'm Cutter Nielsen here with your daily bullet. Nothing for, provides me with the same joy as bringing you the announcements, especially with the knowledge that everyone enjoys it as much as I do. Well, time to get the announcements, just in case you missed it the first 8,000 times. All right, next Monday, right after school, the, you know what? I spend every day reading the same dribble that no one cares about and never get to tell you what I want. So here goes. People come up to me every day and say things like, hey, Cutter, the bullet wasn't funny today. Or, hey, Cutter, the bullet is so boring. I know. Trust me, people, no one dislikes the bullet any more than me. It's not my job to entertain you, but I do my best. Sometimes, sometimes I really just don't care. Also, you all love giving me jokes and other things to say on the air. They aren't funny. Hey, Cutter, you should dab as you walk in like Ty does. Cutter, give me a shout out. Cutter, I know the show is in 30 seconds, but can you say something? Are you kidding me? Why are people so obsessed with having their name read on the air? And how do I even do that? Maybe I should start a shout out list and charge money. Okay, people, time for your daily shout outs. Shout out to Phil, shout out to Sarah, shout out to Arnold. Would that really make you happy? Will that special someone finally notice you because Cutter Gordon Nelson read your name on something that no one really listens to? Give me a break. Gosh, I hate this job. Wow, Cutter. Thanks for that insightful bit of announcements there. Well, that's going to do it for our show. Join us tomorrow when JT Graham reveals that his shirt actually only has one button. For Eagle Nation News, I'm Ben Fine. And I'm Mackenzie Hamilton. Live long and prosper.